brakes. They're the unsung heroes of every truck on the road, stopping tens of thousands of pounds of metal, cargo, and momentum in their tracks. But there's one debate that has truckers, mechanics, and fleet managers divided. Drum brakes or disc brakes? Which is truly the best choice for semi-trucks? Stay with me because the answer might surprise you, and it could change the way you think about your rig's safety and performance. When it comes to brakes on semi-trucks, there's no room for compromise. Safety, durability, cost, and performance all come into play. For decades, drum brakes were the industry standard, and for good reason. They're reliable, robust, and have stood the test of time. But with advancements in technology, disc brakes have entered the scene, boasting improved stopping power and better performance in extreme conditions. So which should you trust when hauling massive loads across highways and steep grades? To answer that, we're going to break it all down. How each brake system works, their pros and cons, and the situations where one might outshine the other. By the end of this video, you'll know exactly which braking system fits your needs. Let's start with the basics, how these braking systems actually work. Drum brakes are like the old school workhorse of the braking world. Inside a drum-shaped housing, brake shoes press outward against the drum's interior surface, creating the friction needed to slow down or stop the truck. It's a tried and true design that's been in use for over a century. Disc brakes, on the other hand, are a more modern innovation. Instead of a drum, you've got a flat disc, or rotor, being clamped by calipers with brake pads. When you hit the brakes, hydraulic or air pressure forces the pads against the disc, creating friction and bringing the truck to a halt. Both systems achieve the same goal, but their methods have unique strengths and weaknesses. Stopping power is where disc brakes often take the lead. Disc brakes offer superior performance in terms of heat dissipation. Imagine you're barreling down a steep grade with 80,000 pounds behind you. The brakes are working overtime, and heat builds up fast. Disc brakes manage heat better, meaning they're less likely to fade under heavy use. Brake fade occurs when the braking system gets so hot that it starts to lose effectiveness. And with drum brakes, this can be a real issue in extreme conditions. Drum brakes, on the other hand, can deliver plenty of stopping power, but they're more susceptible to overheating because the drum design traps heat inside. For long downhill runs or situations where you need consistent braking performance, this can be a critical factor. But does that mean disc brakes always win? Not so fast. There's another side to this story, and we'll get to it in just a moment. Now, let's talk about durability. This is where drum brakes often shine. Drum brakes are built tough, and they're designed to withstand abuse over the long haul. The enclosed design protects the internal components from dirt, water, and debris, making them ideal for off-road applications or environments where conditions are less than perfect. Disc brakes, while highly effective, are more exposed to the elements. Mud, snow, and grit can wear down the components faster, which means they might require more frequent maintenance in certain conditions. But here's the twist. While drum brakes may last longer, they're generally more complicated to service. Adjusting drum brakes requires expertise and time, and poorly adjusted drums can lead to uneven braking. Disc brakes, in contrast, are simpler to maintain. Their straightforward design makes pad replacements quicker and easier, saving time in the shop. But what about cost? After all, what good is a braking system if it breaks your budget? We'll dive into that next. Cost is always a factor, whether you're an owner-operator or managing an entire fleet. Drum brakes are the budget-friendly option up front. They're cheaper to manufacture, and replacement parts are often more affordable. If you're outfitting an entire fleet of trucks, this cost difference can be significant. Disc brakes, however, come with a higher upfront price tag. The advanced materials and technology involved make them more expensive initially. But, and this is a big but, disc brakes tend to pay off in the long run. They often last longer between replacements, and the easier maintenance can reduce downtime and labor costs. For fleet managers, it becomes a balancing act. If you're running routes that require heavy braking, like mountainous terrain, the performance advantages of disc brakes might outweigh the higher cost. But if your trucks operate on flatter routes with less stress on the brakes, drum brakes might be the more economical choice. Regulations also play a role in this debate. In Europe, disc brakes have become the standard for many commercial vehicles, largely due to stricter stopping distance requirements. While the US hasn't mandated disc brakes on semi-trucks, the Federal Motor Vehicle Safety Standards do have specific performance criteria, 
and disc brakes often exceed these standards with ease. From a safety perspective, disc brakes provide more consistent performance, particularly in emergencies. Their faster response time and reduced fade can make all the difference in a split-second situation. So, drum brakes or disc brakes? Who takes the crown? The truth is, it depends. If you prioritize stopping power, heat resistance, and advanced safety, disc brakes are the clear winner. They excel in high-performance situations and offer significant advantages for heavy-duty applications and extreme conditions. But if cost, durability, and simplicity are at the top of your list, drum brakes are still a reliable choice. They've been the backbone of the trucking industry for decades, and for good reason. At the end of the day, the best braking system is the one that meets your specific needs. Whether you're an owner-operator choosing a truck or a fleet manager balancing performance and cost. Now it's your turn. What do you think? Are you team drum or team disc? Share your thoughts in the comments below and let us know about your experiences with these braking systems. If you found this video helpful, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel for more trucking insights, and don't forget to ring the bell so you never miss an update. Stay safe out there, and we'll see you on the road.